Hello. This is review of topics for period English area. Great. For A, B, C, and D. Teacher Laura Camila Forero Gutierrez. First, description of animals. First topic. To describe animals, some structures must be taken into an account such as fears, make complex sentences, two, cave in mean the characteristic of the animal, three, use the appropriate personal pronoun to describe animal it. For example, animal and elephant, lives, Africa, India, Sleeps at night, eats, grace, leaves, dropped off the tree branches. It has a small eyes, big ears, long trunk, two trunks, four legs, long style. Hang above three meters, length six, seven point five meters. Weight books, distance, duration on life. Video. That's okay. Okay, eh, entonces, para describir animales eh, debemos utilizar una estructura, la cual ustedes ya conocen. La primera, hacer oraciones completas, tener presente las características del animal, usar el pronombre personal adecuado para describir animales, el cual es it. That's okay. Second topic. Comparatives expression on difference. To comparate objects, people, or animals, you must remember the four rules. Learning in class. Video. You're faster than me at juggling. Yes, I'm faster than you. I'm better than you at tricks. Yes, but I'm more surprising than you. Boss. <laughs> <laughs> Boss. 
faster. Small. Smaller. Big. Bigger. High. Higher. Safe, safer, noisy, noisier, exciting, more exciting, dangerous. More dangerous. Good. Better. Bad. Worse. That's okay. Yes, two, one. That. Entonces, para comparar objetos, personas o animales, se debe recordar las cuatro reglas aprendidas en clase. Ya las recordamos con el video. Entonces, recuerden, <coughs> ruler one, two, three, four. Third topic. Marine animals body parts. The marine characteristic of each animal must be taken into account. For these you must also take in account the topic description of animals video. Hello, happy friends. Are you ready to learn? I'm Sarah, and today we're going to go deep into the ocean. <sighs> so we can learn fun facts about marine mammals. The blue whale is the largest animal on Earth. It can reach up to us. 30 meters long and it can weigh up to 180,000 kilograms. Their heart is as big as a car and in their mouth we can fit up to 100 people. It's a good thing they aren't carnivores, don't you think? Dolphins are one of my absolute favorite animals. I love dolphins. We've already learned so many things about dolphins in other happy learning videos. Click here if you want to watch. For example, we know that they sleep with one eye open and that they are very social animals. But did you know that in order to swim quicker, they change their skin every two hours? They renew their skin more than we change our t-shirts. Seals and sea lions are very similar, but they don't belong to the same family group. Would you know how to differentiate them? Well, it's easy peasy. If we look closely, we can see that seals don't have ears. They have little holes on each side of their heads so they can hear. Meanwhile, sea lions do have ears, so now we can differentiate them. Sadly, seals and many other marine animals are endangered.
both ocean contamination and legal hunting is extinguishing them. Please, make sure you take good care and respect the oceans and nature as a whole. This is the only way that we will achieve a better and happier world. So goodbye, happy friends. See you next time. And I hope you're always ready to learn. Goodbye. That's okay. Marine animals? Yes. Characteristic of marine animals. One of the apps habitos is the marine. They are those animals done for their life in the seas and the oceans. Marine animals and the mind still fury have an air to remain in salt water and spin a large part on their life in it. There are said characteristics of particular they can be used when identifying marine animals, such as their diet, their weight of breathing, and weight of soil predation. Like we must can look. Question. What is your diet? What is your temperate? How is your habitat? What is your way of breathing? Video. Sea creature factivities. Superpowers. The ocean is home to lots of unusual creatures with strange abilities. Some of these abilities are so odd, they seem like superpowers to us. Here's a rundown of some of the top superheroes in our oceans. Many starfish are able to repair damaged limbs and sometimes regrow whole new ones. Imagine if you could grow yourself a new arm or leg. Stonefish, superpower, deadly disguise. The stonefish is an expert at camouflage. It can hide itself completely among coral where its sharp spines can deliver a deadly poison that can be fatal. Mantis shrimp, superpower, powerful punch. This shrimp might look harmless, but it packs a punch so fast and powerful, it strikes like a bullet and can even boil the water around it. Do you think you could punch so fast you make water boil? Porcupine fish, superpower, extreme growth. This prickly character has an unusual way of tricking predators. By drawing water into its stomach, it can puff up, making itself spiky and three times as big. Sea cucumber, superpower, adaptation. Sea cucumbers can turn their bodies into an almost liquid form and then become solid again. Salmon, superpower, navigational skills. Salmon travel upriver from the ocean to lay their eggs. The journey can be thousands of miles long, but the salmon always know their way back. Would you be able to remember your way home if you were thousands of miles away with no phone or map? Electric eel, superpower, electricity. Electric eels aren't actually eels, but a type of knife fish. They can produce electrical discharges in their bodies that stun and kill their enemies. That's okay. Yours, man, presentation. Question. Una de estas hábitats es la marina. Son aquellos animales que forman su vida en los mares y océanos. Los animales marinos como principal rasgo distintivo tienen su necesidad de permanecer en el agua salada o a pasar gran parte de su vida dentro de ella. Existen ciertas características o particularidades que pueden servir a la hora de identificar a los animales marinos tales como su alimentación, su modo de respiración y formas de reproducción. ¿Qué debemos conocer?
preguntas. ¿Cuál es su alimentación? ¿Cuál es su temperatura? ¿Cómo es su hábitat? ¿Cuál es su forma de respirar? Next. Superlative expressing degrees of difference. Short and lots adjective. Fifth topic. This topic also handles a series of rulers that you will remember now. Video. Goodbye. Presentation. Yes. That's okay. Finish. Natural landmark. Six topic. The beauty of natural gifts on immensity of placing and moments to remember forever. abandoned places. Sixteen, eerily beautiful. This is Kolmanskop, which you can find in Namibia. This little town was thriving in the early part of the 1900s, where there was an influx of German settlers coming to the diamond-enriched areas. However, the diamonds depleted, and by the 1950s, the little town was deserted. Fifteen, if the walls could speak, it would be amazing to unlock the stories and happenings that took place at Angkor Wat, this beautiful abandoned temple discovered in Cambodia. Angkor means city, and Angkor was the capital city from the 9th to the 16th century. This temple is said to be the biggest religious monument in the world, and was originally a Hindu temple. There have been several theories as to why the area was abandoned, from lack of water, disease, natural disaster, and pressure from rivals. 40. Let's sail. If you visit Homebush Bay in Sydney, you will find this the real floating forest inside the ship, the SS Airfield. It was at Homebush that many ships in the 20th century were just left where 
when they were no longer needed. This ship is over 100 years old and used to deliver supplies to American troops when it served as a collier. 13. Gone but not forgotten. We are fortunate to have access to the internet, otherwise we wouldn't even know about half of these beautiful abandoned places. This is a mill discovered in Sorrento, Italy from 1866. The mill was deserted in the 19th century, and National Geographic did a lot of research on the mill, and explained the desertion due to the development of Tasso Square, isolating the mill from the sea, making heat levels rise, and too unbearable to functioning, so it was abandoned. 12. Sad to see it go. This is the Lawndale Theatre, which in its heyday was the place to go in Chicago. It could seat around 2,000 people, which featured movies, then burlesque shows, then back to the movies. It closed down in 1963 and was meant to be demolished in 2014. However, locals say it's still there, and many have been very upset that so much of history was just going to be demolished. 11. Be our guest. This is a big reason to visit Bogota in Colombia, so you can go and visit one of their main tourist attractions. This abandoned hotel is called Hotel de Salta, and you will also witness the Tequium Dama Falls and the surrounding nature. The hotel opened in 1928 and welcomed the wealthier travelers through its doors. The Bogota River eventually got contaminated, and tourists lost interest in going there. It closed its doors in the early 90s, and many believe the hotel is haunted, as so many people have committed suicide there. 10. Not something from a sci-fi movie. This was actually the HQ for the Communist Party in Bulgaria. It looks like a giant flying saucer, and was created by the Communist regime as a meeting place. It was active from 1981 to 1991 and then fell into disrepair when the fall of the Soviet Union took place. Apparently, they are looking into restoring it. 9. Old places have soul. And this exquisite abandoned railway station oozes soul. Its location is the former Russian territory, known as Abkhazia. It was deserted in the 90s, more than likely to blockades imposed by Russia. This type of architecture is known as Stalinist Gothic, or Socialist Classicism. 8. Only memories left behind. This is the Gokhi Island, which forms part of a group of nearly 400 islands called the Shenzi Islands in China. At one stage, it was a super busy fishing village, but with the development of secondary and tertiary industries, many of these little fishing villages didn't last much longer, and people left seeking work elsewhere. 7. Hauntingly beautiful. Sadly, the stories of what went on inside the Beerlitz Hallstatten Hospital are not as hauntingly beautiful as some of the architecture seen in this building. This hospital once had Hitler recovering there for a bit. It saw thousands of TB patients heading through the doors, had murders take place inside, and I'm sure many other atrocities. The sanatorium is in Brandenburg in Germany and sees many people breaking in just to capture some of the beauty that the actual building hosts. 6. A Romantic Tale there doesn't seem to be an exact story as to how the Chatelain Karg graveyard in Belgium came into being, but it's a breathtaking sight. The cars are surrounded by plants, and branches and vines are growing through the vehicles. Reporters say the cars were left in haste, but the romanticized story attached to them is that the cars belong to U.S. soldiers, who left them behind when the war finished and they returned home. 5. Going back in time. This makes me feel like I'm right there at the slave mill in France. Not much is given about this exact blade mill, but the sharpening of blades, scythes, sickles, knives, and swords would have taken place there. Apparently, many grinders died very young due to grinders disease, which is a lung disease more than likely caused from the inhaling of the dust when grinding took place. 4. No trespassing allowed. It's all because of one brave girl that we have access to these beautiful images of an abandoned rocket factory in Russia. We only know her as Lana, and she broke into the factory situated just outside Moscow. As you can imagine, Russian authorities were not happy at all, and even posted threatening letters on her website. So a big thank you, Lana, for showing us what it looks like on the inside. 3. A personal journey. This 27 meter deep well is found in Sintra and is known as the Initiation Well. It's meant to lead one on a journey of self-discovery and rebirth. You're either going into the darkness or coming out into the light. Also could be deemed as death and birth. It was owned by a well-known Freemason who used the well, there are two of them, for ceremonial purposes. They were never used to draw water and every part of the well is symbolic in some way.
to Ghost Town, or rather Ghost Subway. This is stunning. The City Hall subway station in New York and was supposed to be the showpiece when it came to subway stations. However, a mere 41 years after opening, it was actually closed down. For some reason, traffic at that station saw a rapid decline, and then with the onset of the Great Depression and then World War II, the station wasn't used at all, so it was shut down. It received landmark status in 1979, and there were plans in the pipeline a few years ago to bring it back to life. 1. History Created This breathtaking crystal mill is from 1892 and is actually a decompressor station. Constructed in 1893, it was used as a power plant. This mill is said to be one of the most photographed sites in Colorado in the U.S. and has a place on the National Register of Historic Places. That's okay. Natural Landsmar. La belleza de la naturaleza nos regala inmensidad de lugares y momentos para recordar por siempre. Listo, entonces espero que este review, este repaso de temas, haya sido de gran utilidad para ustedes, recordando temas, recordando palabras, vocabulario y sobre todo aprendiendo a escuchar y a interpretar la información que nos dan como una instrucción o como un relato. That's okay. Goodbye. Until next time. Adiós.